So uh, we are just about to start the timer. X-Wing players, time is on. I'll turn them, I'll start it. Good luck. May the force be with you. Okay, so the timer is go. These guys are just finishing off their setup. Thank you, sir. Coffee, delicious. So we are a little bit of a late start this morning, but we are well underway. And, uh, oh, there you go. There's the happy handshake. And these gentlemen are off and running. Oh, man. Is it ever good to see Rack on the board? I know, right? I haven't seen... I haven't seen somebody fly a Desi since like in comp yeah. since a, for a long time. Oh, in comp, yeah. Yeah, I, and honestly, I'm not seeing the Desi a lot, even I, in cash play lately. So, I think Aaron, Aaron, uh, locally played the Desi once last week, uh, and then he was like, oh, "All right, that's enough. You're going away." <laughs> it's a bit of an unwieldy ship. It it certainly can but be. It, it can certainly, certainly can hit be. pretty hard if you uh, do it upright. Yep. That's a little easier. Oh, so we're a little out of focus there. You do realize I'm uh, getting my eyes checked these days, right? Oh, buddy, no. You just, <laughs> you just fucked it. How bad? Like, it's not even showing the screen anymore. Oh, there there we go. Okay. It oh. zooms. So, like, look oh, at the that, star field. Well, it's better now. No. Yep. Look at the star field. We are looking at Tell a Tell me that the star field is in sharpness or not. Okay, it oh. is not. I see. Okay, start adjusting. Other way. Other, yeah, Other no. Way. Oh, back. Oh, back. Slowly, slowly. Keep going, slowly. Right there. there. Yeah, that's that pretty looks, nice. Okay. <laughs> that looks better. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, ready? Yes. We'll give you guys an extra ten seconds just in case. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, I don't, I don't know if they're gonna go to time even. Although five Tempest squadrons, that's actually a lot to chew through. Um, and they, they are potentially very damaging. Like, uh, ostensibly they are two dice attacks, but with target locks, uh, they are a three dice attack and a, and a turn up into crits. Yeah. So, uh, no dice cam today, guys. Use the tray if you'd like, but you don't have to. Okay. I'm just going to reveal them all just because the elements. No, it looks sweet. Oh, what's that? Shaking this morning. Oh, Kipper's dice. Nice. They're all just going to focus. I don't know how casual they are. Sorry. Pretty cash. Pretty cash. <laughs> well, I like to call this this uh, particular level of competition competitively casual. I like it. R E L Axe. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, no. Got to make sure that quizzy goes first, right? So Ian, actually one of the only folks I've seen using the official uh, FFG uh, uh, templates that the uh, acrylic templates they've created, um, actually looks really good. Uh, I thought they would look way more train tracky, but they don't. They At least I don't think they do. They, they look. They actually look remarkably surface of the Death Scar it. Yeah, and that, I think that's kind of the point. Yeah. Pushing hard with Rack. He's trying to get a good flank going on here. I'm not sure whether Jesse's going to try and burn down Rack first or if he's going to try and chase uh, Fell and the Inquisitor. It's an easy target to focus on. It is an easy target, and honestly, if it, if it was me, I'd be really torn as, uh, on this. And there he is pushing up the side of the board. Suntir Fell doing what he does, driving people crazy. Just gonna take some shots. 
some picks. No comment. No shot. Sweep and set. Away he goes. You know me, I'm a degenerate. That's why I keep flying scum. <laughs> All right, I'm back. Took some pictures. Oh, I, you know what? The only match I didn't take a picture of was this one. Huh? I mean, it's kind of on camera. I know. But this way I can post them all up on fa on the uh, Facebook and stuff while we're at it. Okay. Looks like Jesse's all dialed in. Ian nods that he's ready. Oh, looks like he is turning towards the... Yep, there it is. He's going to let Fell come in on the flank and try and push in damage on Rack. I don't blame him. Close one, almost bumping ships there. Almost. Almost. Getting, oh man, getting tight. Keep, keeping getting a tight really formation. tight over there. Almost too tight. Though, it is much quieter here this year. It is. It is. I and think I overall think, there's less people. Yeah, you can hear yourself think. Yeah, I know. It was crazy loud last year. And we didn't have this cool setup like we do this year. So yeah. our, our camera was uh, pretty jank last year, actually. It looked really bad. I'm really grateful that we have a much better setup this year. Come a long way since then. Yep. Oh, tight on the rock, but not on it. Oh, Jesus. You could not fit a template between that. That is tight like a toy gun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Definitely yeah, don't yeah. want to have that in front of you. Yeah, there comes the barrel roll. Now it looks like he's going to have a range three unobstructed. Maybe. Ooh, maybe. That is a tight range there. And Fell just simply pushing up the side of the board. Doing uh, fell things. 
And a boost, there you go. Start the, uh, start the corner there. Oh, well, that's not that big a deal though, because there's nobody in between, so. Oh, go rack, buddy, oh boy. Oh, I can't look. This is gonna be an interesting round. <laughs> I know, right? Like, ooh, baby. I only managed to get two target locks. Yeah, only, only two. two. Right? Oh, wow. Wow, Jesse only got two target locks in on that. Oh, uh, which one of you guys is player one? I guess it doesn't really matter in the end, does it? Uh, I, I gave in this. Ian, Ian is player one, okay. Yeah, he's got the bow tie turret. No, it's based off of whatever you're available. Uh, that is his primary number arc. Four. It's a turret. Right. Arc number four. So just one shield. Yep. Yeah. Unless you spend a green token, which he doesn't have. To be All right. So so Ian is Vadering. Number four. Number four. Okay. Which is that one? Okay. So on the left side, second one down. Got it. So number four. I'm gonna give these guys some damn numbers here. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, uh, two, one, four, five, six. Yeah. You missing number three? three? Yeah, it's a thing. I use high numbers now because all my low numbers are missing. <laughs> two. Oh man, number four really getting the beats on him here. He's obviously offended by your inability to count. Check and out the range one. I think that might be range one. Oh, no, it's range oh, two. Oh, no, yeah. Good eyes. So it was number four that ended up taking two so far? Number four is taking one. One. Okay. Oh, and now he's shooting at him. That's right. There you go. All right, and so there he is. He's using Rack's ability now. Yeah, yeah but he's he's side arc. He's in front of the half. Yeah, in front of the half mark. Yeah. Okay. So he has reinforcement against every shot you take. Yeah. yeah. Because all of your guys are considered. And so there is the turn up for hit crit crit from Rack into number four, who goes, I like it. Yeah, I'm gonna take it all. Oh boy, he's not dead yet, but maybe. Might be hit Might. two crit. Yeah. Mostly dead. So, so hit hit, and what's the crit? Hit, hit two crit. They're both crit. No, I had one shield. Oh, one shield. Okay, yeah. you're right. And then hit crit. You're right. Crit, crit. Hit, crit. Oh, so the hit. You got two crit. Oh, so two face up. Two yeah, face two up. face up. There right, you go. Right, right. Sorry, right. Wounded right. pilot and damage sensor array. Not good. Not good. But, he's not but he didn't yet. kill it. He still gets to pull the trigger at least once. So this, this is not bad. So that puts uh, Ian up by 20 to start. But now there's going to be five. Five shots gonna come at frickin' Oh no, I know the Inquisitor still, yeah. And it looks like that's gonna touch on number five. Wow. Wow, okay. Wow, he really does not want to live, does he? No. Uh, five. So you're going to spend the focus for one, and number five is going to take two. Oh, just one shield? Oh, there's the one of eight. There it is, yep. Boom. Wow. That, that could have gone worse, but it could have gone a lot better. Okay, so I'll start with number six. So okay, so number six is the closest. He has a target lock, so he has three die primary plus one for range one. So we got a four dice attack coming from number six. He's got a target lock, but no focus. 
Oh boy. Now, I believe you can use the um, advanced targeting computer to turn one up and then spend your target lock. But I can only change hits to crits, right? Uh. You can only hit your yeah. crit? Yeah, so you don't so have. So. You might as well just tar spend the target lock and re roll all Up to you? I don't have focus for that, so. All right, so he's going to spend the Tarje for the three. Into wow. the same result. Right. A single crit coming through on Rack. And Rack goes, that's fine. Because there's nothing he can do about it. Okay, so he's shooting with number four, who uh, also with the target lock. Okay. There we go. There we go. Hit, crit, crit. And so two more off of Rack. Wow, he still got shields. He's doing good. Then I have do number two, which is range two. So attack for number two, also range two. This guy has got no target lock but a focus. And he's going to spend that to turn up for one. And so Rack is shields down. Ciao. So I've attacked with two, four, and six. So I still have five and one, right? Yep. Also range two from the look of it. Awesome. Nothing. Nothing. All right. And then number one. Sort of. Oh, I'm pretty sure if, if you had number five at uh, range two, yeah. Oh, that's much better, and especially with the hull down. Reinforce for one, and then he takes a crit against the hull. Oh! Ow! 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 All right, well, that still keeps Ian in the lead with 20 points, because he got half on the one. Uh, Jesse did not manage to push half through on Rack yet. And now we got the Inquisitor and uh, Fell coming in behind. This should be very, very interesting. Man, these guys are just baking their brains thinking about where to go and what to do here. I can smell the smoke, I swear. <laughs> Although that could just be me thinking really hard as well, so. Man, that one Tempest number four is in a real bad way. He took a pretty solid hit there. He did. Wounded pilot and damage sensor array are really going to limit his ability to deal with stuff. Well, you can tell he's wounded. I mean, Vader force choked him. <laughs> I'd be wounded too, yeah. deeply in my heart. <laughs> How dare you? I thought we were on the same team. <laughs> Vader has his own team. Yeah. Yeah. Vader is his own team. Oh, there you go. Jesse Styles down. We get the thumbs up and the nod from the other. All right. I think we're good. Yeah, 
I forgot he has proton bombs. Oh no! Oh no! I think Jesse might have forgotten about because, the system phase. Because he was sneaky and didn't have them on the table yeah, ready to I go. Saw him. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh no, the cards are there. Just He didn't have the template sitting there ready to drop, right? Yeah. Uh, if you'd like, I have a pro. I have one. Yeah, give me give me two seconds. <laughs> Casually comp here, everybody. Casually comp. Rack might single-handedly win this game. <laughs> a rack can single-handedly win a lot of things. Oh God, no! You can tell he went to Chipotle earlier. <laughs> He's dropping a bomb. Wait, wait. All right. Well, is that Chipotle secret ingredient? Uh, High yeah. energy protons? Um, yes. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, it looks like it clears the rock, but he's gonna have a bad day. A Goodbye, bad number day. four. <laughs> oh, number four, I hardly knew Number him. four is dead. Not yet. Not yet. He's still got action. Number four is dead. <laughs> yes, there you go. And that's exactly what I would do. Uh, although I might, I personally might have done that a little different. I might have done the focus link barrel roll myself. But. Uh, Jesse forgot about his linked action. Uh -huh. That's why. Now he doesn't have a green token to survive Vader. Well, I don't think Vader. Vader's going to end up in it. Uh, uh, you don't think he's going to end up with Vader having an arc on him. Um, I could see the Inquisitor coming around and finishing off that one last hit. If that rack yeah. comes around and does a hard turn. Won't be close enough. I don't think he'll be close enough. Vader's That's be range. within range one to two. Yeah. And I think he'll be range three at that point. Eh, yeah, maybe. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, that poor bastard. Not rolling out the barrel there. Well, that's okay. Number six is that? Is that number six? He's fine. Uh, now the others might end up colliding from the look of it. What's his action? No point in barrel rolling. It's not going to get me away from it. So. Yeah, so, yeah, he's got no choice. He's got no barrel roll there because the rock's in the way. Uh, he is not going to barrel roll. He can't barrel roll the other direction and get any further away from it. He's got no boost. He is simply going to target lock rack because he can soak that. It's one more shield. It's fine. So number two coming up now. Do, do proton bombs not hit under the shields anymore? No, it's just a crit, not a face-up damage card, which whew, change the game. so much better. Yeah, change the bombs for sure. Yeah. Oh yeah, there we go. He's trying to cause a bump. That's number two. Number two also taking a target lock on rack. That is three target locks racked up on rack there. Another one. He's just softing in. He is not worried about those flankers. He really, really wants to put everything he can into rack from the look of it. Another target lock. Holy smokes. Are we going for five target locks here? It, it looks like it might be. And last but not least, number one with the red S for or with the uh, red uh, uh, solar panels there. That is everybody locked on rack. Wow. They love him so much. Inky doing a forward four. Just a generic quizzy coming on up. There he is. Yes. Yes. You have. You're still overlapping you the cloud. Have completed a maneuver on top of the cloud. Stopping is completing a maneuver. 
And here goes Rack. Stopping's gonna stress you anyway. Hard turn two, which is a bump. Oh, things are gonna get real here. Things are gonna get really real. You guys need train tracks? Oh. That looks about right on mine. If you guys are good with it, I'm good with it. However, that's uh, where that title comes into play now. So he's going to coordinate a boost to the Inquisitor. It can't. It can't. He's uh, coordinating to. Uh, hold on. You got to measure range on that. So he's going to attempt to coordinate out of range. So no thur. That's why I asked if the decimator could. Boost. Yeah. Now, is that. It's not stressful, is it? Yes, it is. Isn't that a failed, yes. And that's a failed action. Well, uh, yeah, it's technically a failed action, but he but still picks up the stress. He just doesn't get a chance to coordinate anybody else. Okay, and then Fel. Ah, uh, yeah, Fel's just pushing in. Doing what he does, hurting cats. Oh, I see. So he's going to boost Fell. He's going to try a straight boost here. Ooh, it's a little tight to the rock, but I think he's going to clear. Oh, nice. Yep. That was less tight than the maneuver with the Inquisitor last couple turns there. Oh, yeah. yeah the, nope, no auto thrusters. Okay, so he's not choosing to barrel roll. All right, so we get end of the engagement, uh, or end of activation, beginning of the engagement phase. Uh, end of activation, the bomb blows up. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Bommy bomb bomb. Oh, no. So number six takes it. And Rack bombs himself. One crit. One crit. One on your shield. If, if it's a shield, it bounces off your shield. Otherwise, it's a face-up damage crit. So number six takes one. And Rack takes... Blinded. Pilot. Ow. With nine hit points left. So there's one proton bomb down. Vader. It's number yeah, four. Four. This one here. Four is the one closest to you. Yeah, four is the one on the other side of the rock there. You do get to measure for range for Vader, of course, so. So it looks like you got a, you got almost all of them. I really wish I'd used that link. Action. I know, right? <laughs> and one, and he Vader just crushes him like a freaking tin can. Right? It's telekinesis, Kyle. <laughs> all right, that pushes Ian ahead to 40 points now. So soon to your no shot. We move to rack. So we got number two, number one, and number five. 
And number five and number six have already taken one each, right? Yes. Yeah, five and six, okay. So hit crit, he's not gonna modify uh, anything else because he can't. And apparently he likes, man, your ships love blasters. I don't get it. Yeah. <laughs> so one face up. So one, one last shield and a face up damage card on number five. Loose stabilizer. Ooh, be careful about them turns. Uh, straight maneuvers. Is it the straight? Yeah. Oh, non -straight. After you non -straight. execute a non-straight maneuver. So yeah. watch your banks. Oh, okay. Uh, now you're in quizzer. And that now pushes Ian ahead even further. Oh my god, 60 points now because he's got one down and half on another. And Jesse does not quite yet have half on rack. That rack is doing some work. That rack is I doing great. A single abated, no, right? you've been your your green dice have been cold. Yeah. Oh. All right, Quizzy uses force to turn up for one. So that was on number five, right? Yeah. Well, oh, number one. Okay. There we go. There's some two of aids. Nice. Oh my God! You avoided something. <laughs> Oh, just when he needed it. Yep. Okay, so we'll do number one first. Four dice, range one, with a dark dog. Wow. Wow, you got... It's excellent. There's nothing wrong. Nothing to see here. Okay, so, uh, spending the target lock. So that's number one. Uh, <coughs> Three blanks re-rolled into three focuses, or three eyeballs. Okay, so one face up from number one. Okay. Okay, we'll do number five. Four dice, range one. You know what? I'll switch no two of these. You're jostling the camera pretty good. All right, all right. So now I can advance targeting computer this way. And then I can bend the target log. It's not charging? No, uh, it's the adapter itself. I tried a couple different things, so. Okay. Okay, so how did that turn out? Uh, not well. I re rolled uh, three blanks with the target lock. Into? I got into three eyeballs, and I had to. <laughs> Spooky eyeballs. All right, uh, back to dial. No, it's it's the power adapter because I had it plugged into this one and it wasn't uh, it wasn't charging. That one is. The other one ain't. What do you mean the other one is? Yeah, but that's not the one that's plugged in. It is. Yeah, I just I swapped them earlier because this thing was saying it was saying it was gonna die. Good times. Small geek technical difficulties, everybody. Par for the course with us. Yep. Par for the course. If we're not having technical difficulties, there's something horribly wrong. Difficulties, we're experiencing difficulties. Oh, 
Tiles are going down. Between recording sessions, we'll just swap them. With, with foresight and snapshot. Yep. Um, they cannot be used during the combat phase. Okay. Cannot be used during the combat phase anymore. So with snapshot, do they rule it now? So like if you land in, you land in within the range two band at all. Any part of you lands within range two band, you're range two. It's just like measuring for an attack. Even if you're also range one, it's you're still if if the corner of your ship is within that range two band. No. Snapshot is no. No. If you are too close, you're too close. If you are, if you just corner into the range two band on the outside of it, you're just right. No matter what, you always get to measure if someone lands in front of you, though. <clears throat> Oh, you lost one and I didn't even notice there. Oh no, I did. Apparently I did. Never mind. What? He'd lost a ship and I didn't think I'd lo I didn't think I'd removed it. Oh. Oh, he's dropping his second bomb. Might as well. Right? Nope. Well, I mean, if it explodes there, that's even worse, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, and so number six is just getting the hell out. I don't blame him. Nope, no, no loose stabilizer damage, just gonna be the proton bomb instead. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to take both. Yeah, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, Number two. Oh, Talon three. Oh, that's gonna be tight. Uh, let's template Rack from the back there. Here we go. And Jesse getting that T roll three in there. Looking good, looking good. Tight to the edge of the board there, that was nice. And the rack has coming back. Oh, he's, he's looking to... Oh, uh, look at that, number one also doing a T-roll. Smart chosen to steer away from the bombs. Yeah, right? Right? <laughs> at least one, at, the second one. At least one of them anyway. Yeah. Only once. Yeah. <laughs> and three was on this guy, right? Yes. Okay, pretty colors and keep it distracted. There we go. Rack back in place. Template removed. That's everybody. Yep. That's it. That's all she wrote. So we got the tap going forward two from the look of it. Oh man. Oh man. Number five is so massacred. 
Poor number five. Oh god. It's the opposite of short circuit. Five, number five, not alive. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, he's going to boost on up. Yeah, straight boost right up behind. There you go. Oh, yeah, that's nice. That that looks like that might actually be a range one shot. And, uh, so he's going to push into his focus. There you go. So linked action focus. Five is very dead. Well, it's looking like five is in a real bad place right now. That's for sure. Two and one and two are in a good position to avenge him though. So yeah, right. Oh no. Another one of those moments where he just doesn't get out. Uh, just set, set a template along the side and push him forward. Yeah. So Rack's not even going to clear. He's just, but it doesn't matter because Dauntless Title says take a goddamn action anyway. Oh, I'm not sure he got away enough, far enough away from the bomb. He didn't. He's eating it. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? It's more important that number five eats it in this case. So yeah. Oh, Ken's here too, nice. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of people here I recognize, that's nice. First time I've like looked up and sort of like, who's here? <laughs> Is Ken dice bag? All right, he's gonna reinforce to the front. Uh, no, he's uh, curious. Okay. He works out at the Langford Curious location. Oh, okay. Um, used to play a bunch of X-Wing with him back in the day before he decided to jump ship for Legion like a damn coward. Kick him while he's down. <laughs> That's the soon tier way. Keep him out of the fight until. Damn right, damn right. Soon tier doesn't engage. He doesn't like joust. He doesn't do that shit. He takes pot shots from the flank because he's a dick. That's <laughs> so, so all there is to it, man. That's a fair fight. <laughs> yeah, totally. Yeah, I don't see any problem here at all. <laughs> yep, I would. Oh! Not what I expected. Oh, wow. He's barrel rolling out. Yeah, I thought he was going to barrel roll to try to line up the Predator. Uh, well, number six is still doing got pretty predator. good. I was expecting him to try to line That's it what up. I was, well, and then he'd get the free focus out of the, out of the uh, bullseye arc exactly. as well, but... He's already committed but to the But he has a now. different master plan. He, he does, he does. He's gonna one heart he's gonna one heart him out next turn. That decimator has been having like all these ships hanging around in the turn. The decimator has been pummeling though. Doing work. Has been decimating his force. All around, blinded pilot. So that was number five. Took blinded pilots, and Rack has a damaged engine now, eh? What is he? Four crits now? Four crits. Direct hit, blinded pilot, loose stabilizer, damaged engine. <laughs> Am I missing one? Huh? A uh, console fire. There it is. Yes, it will. <laughs> and then it was number five that took another one, right? Oh boy. Oh boy, man, that that proton. Mm. Beautiful, baby, beautiful. So start a combat. Start of engagement. He's gonna favor somebody. Oh, oh, poor number five. It's gonna crush him like a bug.
feel like I should uh, be quoting Edgar Phelps. Do it. Do it. Yeah, totally. <laughs> it's a palp do it moment. Oh, he's going to clear the token instead off six. Yep, he's definitely yeah. going to clear the token. I'm actually really surprised. I was ex expecting him to crush number five like a little bug. Oh, here comes Rack. He's got a shot on number two or number five. So he's Ian's taking the shot on number two here. Again, I'm. Oh no, no, I'm not uh, actually that surprised. He doesn't want to kill number five and have the Inquisitor with no shot. So, fair. I guess that's fair. And number two gets to shoot back his turn now. Number five doesn't. Yeah. Oh boy. Three hits. No mods. Don't let me down now, green dice. All right. Oh, they will. Wait. Uh, oh, wait. Aren't you reinforced to the front? I am. Does that not mean you can turn up? Who's attacking? Aren't you attacking his number two, right? Yes. And if you're reinforced the front, can you not turn it? Yeah. There we go. That's a little better. And then Jesse ends up. That would normally be a missed opportunity. That that would that would. But we're gonna we're gonna let that slide for now. Casually competitive. Casually competitive. This is a tournament. That is true. So actually, yeah. For now, we'll, we're please remember next time. But yes. Oh. Oh, you're right. Console bar. We have to do no damage. So okay. So we'll make that three hits, and number two ends up taking one. Yes. Okay. All right. There we go. Then. You know what? It happens. It happens. You just you just want to make sure that number th that uh, your quiz has something to shoot at. Yeah. <laughs> And now you're three. Okay, so the so it looks like that generic inquisitor has a range one. Definitely a range one shot. Three dice, no waiting, one force, and a focus. Woo! He's gonna force up for one for a hit and a crit. And number five says, I like that. <laughs> Just what I always wanted. <laughs> uh, that was just, that was, that was, uh, hit, hit crit. It was hit crit? Okay. <clears throat> I don't think Ooh. you really play anymore, but I'm glad that I am on yesterday. Oops. Two days ago. Right. Sorry, hold on. So, Julie and hand is removed. Four days oh, nice. And I have a six star pattern, yet, and I don't have a general, you know, or general skywalker. Not yet, but all right. I'm gonna hashtag soon. I have always had all of the heroic characters. Nice. So far, I've had to spend my target lock every time, so I might as well keep the theme going. Yeah, the theme. right. Why not? Keep the theme. Yeah. <laughs> there we hey, go. Hey, so that's hit, hit, crit against Rack, right? Yeah. Hit and a crit. Now, do you still have the target lock? No, you spent it, right? I spent it. Yeah. Okay. So two well, hits I, and a crit. No, a right? hit and a crit. He has reinforced. Oh, you're right. A hit crit. So. Ooh. Wait, didn't you already have fuel leak? No, that was somebody else. No. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, looks like number and one. And four hit points left on rack. Number one has a shot on the Whoa, number one's gonna pot shot of the Inquisitor. Range two? Yeah, two dice, yeah. range two. Two more. Yeah. So that's just two more. Sorry? Yeah, so you got four left? Oh! Oh, the direct hit, that's right. Okay. So this is number one on the Inquisitor. Wow. 
Quizzy takes it's one. Those, it's those green dice, man. You can't trust them. You, you can't, can't trust them. <laughs> And I think that is that's it. Alright, back to Dow. And there were three. Hey Jonas, what faction are you flying? Huh? Republic? Uh, I'd love love that, please. Yeah. Well, thank you, good sir. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Chloe and Mace, love it. Into the next round. Uh, so, system space, I don't think you have any more bombs. So, Not this bombs. game. This guy. Oh, that's pretty tight. I can't see it, but oh! Just short. That is some tight flying. God damn. Um, the, the next. Approximately 20 minutes left, X Wing. 20 minutes. I know I see Chloe and Mace together, which makes me happy. What is, where is the... Nice! Well, we'll get you on camera. Gotta get those all parts in our uh, paint jobs out here. Which is... Me? Okay. Me? Did he show you? Jen did an amazing job on this, man. Like, I think the blow looks better than the spread. This guy is just doing a two-four. Right? 
Banking out. No bomb to worry about this time, so. Last year I had a fucked up back like that. You did? This year it's not the back. Nope. My leg. Yep. My legs, man. Uh, part of me that's having the trouble keeping up with this new job. That's just old age. That's just old age no, racking up on you, isn't it? Man. Oh, yeah, I suppose. I just have to condition myself. You're just not used to it anymore. Well, that's just it. I got really pissy with my last job. Yeah. Okay, good. It was there. part of my back, but it was otherwise oh, no. quite black. Yep, yep, yep. Wait a moment, just happened over there with the war machine. Or yeah, I can hear the. Oh, oh, it's probably some crazy dice rolls. Straight two is the blue. Well, you just want to leave it there. Yeah, I was going to say, if there's enough, I'm going to give one to everybody. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. And one left over. Cars. Twenty minutes. Twenty. Yeah. Uh, just under twenty. Eighteen minutes left. Roll for damage and no action. Damage on the here. Yeah, regular damage on the Yeah, just regular. These are really good. I know. Really Little clone trooper helmet. I love them. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't get an action when you fly through a rock, anyways. Those are from worlds. Yes, you're right. That would have been for the auto thrusters. Oh, oh. Yeah, sure. Glenn, can you auto thrusters after flying through a rock? No. Uh, auto thrusters is off of an action, right? No, no. Auto. Uh, what is the exact wording of auto thrusters again? After you complete? No action. After you perform an action. Yeah, I was gonna say it's not do a boost. It's take a boost action. And it's not even a. Which no. Is yeah. 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 Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. so oh we'll man. Combat. There's so combat. much good shit in here. Oh. Uh, yeah, he has no tokens, so. Okay. Yeah, nice. All day, every day. All park snapshots. Okay, it's not range restricted. No. Oh shit. That's just sick. Uh, if you have someone in. I think he might be in range, so it probably doesn't matter, but just for clarification, Soon Tier's ability does not have to be within range 3? Uh, yes. It does? So we yes, it does. If, if you measure range, and it's out of range 3, it's it, not bullseye either. It's not considered in your arc at all if it's out of range. Yeah. It is your a, arc is the is length range. of your arc ruler, of yeah. the length of your ruler. You don't have a range 4, for example. Unless you're a captain ship. Yeah, I don't see no epic today. <laughs> Number one. So we got Sim Tier taking a shot. Oh, okay. Man, it's exactly so good. Good. <laughs> Sometimes it's too bad that we run these things instead of I know, right? 
It's okay, there's more than enough to go around, so. Oh, wow. That, honestly, is going to be tough. Soon tears of boss. Strawberries to it. The rest can be selected prizes. Okay, now, so we go. focus. So, one, that's number six, so one shield. He can't because they're in base contact. And he's not a hero arc. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's got a new attack. <laughs> yep. Okay. How'd that turn out? Uh, hmm? Okay. Who, who, what, what damage? Um, number two took one. One shield on six. Okay. One shield on number six, and that's so it shield, so far? Shield's down on six now. Um, I'm going to check for range. It's probably range three extracted, which means we will be in a rare situation where... The decimator gets two dice. Oh no, maybe it is. Jesse's gonna have to really push here to make up the uh, loss here. Okay, so you do get one die because it's obstructed. Okay. Oh, six. Hmm. Well, I had to spend my focus token, so I'll advance targeting computer this one. And then I will six to this five. Um I'm gonna re-roll this one with fire control. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Pulls up double crits. Two crits, and that is that is it. all she wrote for Rack, isn't it? Oh, ciao. Yep, fuel leak, and oh no! All right, so Rack is down, which uh, actually now puts Jesse ahead by 25 points. It is still 12 minutes to go. Anybody's game, though. Yeah, they're about 20 seconds apart. Uh, this was... Nope. Yeah! Ventress from last year.
right, just over 10 minutes remaining left in round one. Ian has indicated his readiness. Strat, roll Nat, right? So. <laughs> oh, there we go. Pushing on up with number one. Jesse really still has his work cut out for him, though, nailing down the last two ships. They are still pretty fresh. Yeah, I was hoping to have not lost so many uh, ships by this point. I mean, yeah, it's been a it's been a fairly uh, even trade here. Uh, you getting rack though has definitely pushed you in a bit of the into a bit of the lead. If uh, if Ian can manage to get half on at least one more of your ships, uh, that at least puts him back into contention. But he needs to either half two of them or kill one, I think, to get himself back in the lead. How many points is Ian? Yeah, what's up? Missiles when it hits, does that one that got hit flip over? Uh, no. Okay. Because it's it's either. before damage is dealt. Yeah. Okay. It hits. Yeah does the thing and then you deal the damage card. Great. Yeah, so you can't flip the damage card that you inflict from it. Yeah. No, that would just be too too gross. Yeah. <laughs> Opening up his arcs a bunch there. Number one probably doesn't have a shot, but two and and or six might. Interesting, looking good for him. Starting with Kyle. Nice. And I uh, brought a bunch of my own as well. Excellent. So I got like dial covers Perfect. and uh, uh, bases and the cards that Jonas brought. Excellent. So I, I put some of those aside as uh, top four. I've got another kit. Nice. From, um, Full set of tokens from Realm. Yeah, a judge on his way. I was not happy with the round. I've been trying to get to this point for months and he stopped responding to me. He stopped responding to a lot of folks. Because apparently he, he lost access to his Twitter for two weeks. He could have responded and told someone. I know. I know. I was going to get him to do all the trophies. For now, we'll. Hey, Glenn, it's not. A, you don't gain a stress if uh, you fail an action, do you? No, unless it was a red action. Yeah. No, you, yeah, you're fine. Yeah, yeah. No, fail is just like, yay! You get nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you done? Oh, nice. How'd you guys do? Oh my God. 
I, I started combat, so uh, I got 200, you got 22. Inquisitor don't have a shot. Ooh. I don't think I have a shot. I think I have a shot. I should check with number two. Or where are the heck are you? Okay, so you got 200. Very nice, sir. And 22 there. Thank you. Congrats on your win. First, <laughs> first time uh, since the very beginning of the game we've had no shots. Three minutes, X Wing. Three minutes in round one. He didn't shift really, so. She did the Asajj, right? Sorry? Did she do the one last year? Yes. Yeah, she did the Asajj as well, so. Uh, here, I'll show you the Kylo, actually. Uh, sad Kylo is sad. Oh. <laughs> Uh, Quizzy, trying to get around. Oh, uh, there he goes. Oh, man. Well, we got a minute left. So, yeah, like, this is it. Risk it for the biscuit. Oh, he blocked Phil. Oh, no, a hard one the other way. Oh, shizball. Oh, because he got targeting computer, that's right. So, target lock. And then auto thrusters into the boost. There we go. Man, targeting computer on Fell is just degenerate bullshit. I love it. And it's not very expensive. No, it's cheap. It's super cheap. It, it's almost a must. Like, just, oh, what is it? Two points? It used to be. I, I, I think it's like two or three now. Like, it's ridiculously cheap. 
Uh, 15 seconds, last round. I have to spin the focus. But blank, basically blank it out, so no damage. X Wings, that is time. Finish your round, tally your results. Three dice, yep. What? Who needs punching? What's going on? One crit. Oh! Good game. All right, gentlemen, how did it end here? No damage. No damage all around. Oh my god. And so there we are. Time called. Jesse eking out the win at 105 by killing Rack. With no help Ian trying days. really hard to get back there manages to get 80 points. And a tight game, a very tight game, gentlemen. Well flown. Thank you for being on uh, on uh, Geek Tech Industries. Thanks everybody for joining us, and don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll be back with some more matches today, so keep your eyes peeled on our channel for that, and we'll see you guys next time here on the mat.